Now we can hear our synth. Notice that we can draw in the velocity too. Remember that velocity, or the intensity of the sound, is controlled by the gate. I have a nice retro synth line going. So now we need to modulate the cutoff frequency using CV. On the back of the subtractor, we can see a whole bunch of inputs for things that can be modulated. So we make a cable from our curved output of the matrix. The curved part of the matrix is particularly well suited for tweaking parameters on unit. Make sure you see the video on matrix for more detail. On the front panel of the matrix, let's switch the matrix to curve and draw in some automation and use it to affect the cutoff. So I've drawn in some cutoff and now we can hear it. Hmm, that sounds cool. Maybe we should use the matrix curve data to simultaneously modulate another parameter. For that, we'll need our good friend, the CV merger and splitter. We can feed one CV signal into it and route it to other modulation possibilities. I'd like to reroute the output from the matrix into the split A input. Then, I'll take the first output and route it to cutoff so we get that back again. 